Hello, welcome to Team Show. New update. So season eight, the forge, which you can forge new upgrades using mastery three points gained by fighting other players and leveling up. The debt you can get the dagger or the mythic dagger, which is um, poisonous. The scythe, which you can evade enemies and strike with multi-target attacks. Use mythic scythe the Nauk turn to deal lunar damage to enemies. The great hammer so swinging with a massive punch, like say. Tier 0 speed adende, but max damage adende. That's what you could compare that to, probably. The sword, typical yet trusty sword, upgrade for extra damage. Ranged for sharpshooters, upgrade the wood bow to the headhunter. <sighs> armor, increase your health and toughness with armor upgrades. Obviously, by the battle pass. I'm not, I'm not gonna sugarcoat the fact that you just need to buy the battle pass to get most of the kits if you want stuff just get the battle pass it's worth it anyways emotes kits i'll explain that core game changes everyone's at 100 hp you can see their hp when you're fighting them and um if you're level 20 you're gonna be with a lot more level 20s and if you're level one you're gonna be with a lot more level ones that's how it's going to work. Anyways, ranked restarted. And um, ranked season 7 is done. You will get a great Pirate Davy skin at the, at the launch of ranked season 8, which is next update. So, Also, stop worrying about ranked. Stop it. It's fine. It's ranked. Anyways, free kits of the week. Oxalotl Amy, Freya, Baker, and Jade. I would recommend Oxalotl Amy or Jade. None of the stuff in between. Anyways, there's a new sky atmosphere in match music and summer and lobby music. It's quite good. I like the lobby music. Anyways, how do I get the most XP? First, buy the battle pass. I've said that. Buy it. It's worth it. Second, you want to go to your missions. And if you have a lot of mission tickets, go ahead and use them. But, for fireballs, you go ahead, go into 30v30. For telepearl missions, go into 30v30, you have a lot of time to pearl around. But the best strat for pearling, build a pillar up to sky limit, and then pearl to the furthest but lowest place possible. That'll get the most blocks. Anyways, 20 kills, just go on solos or something. Break three beds, go on solos, duels. It's, I mean, like... There's a double duel, like 2v2. There's, and then the Teleporal's mission, which I explained. So, I would do that. How? What's the best mode? I completed all the missions. What's the best mode for all of this? Yeah, you can just play any mode you want. That's not, you don't want a mode like Gun Game. No offense to gun game, but it doesn't give a lot of XP because of short matches. You want to make your match longer, just like clan contribution. Mine's 3011. I know this. Get a long match. Long matches equal more clan contribution. And hit play right after. Hit play again. But that's just clan contribution. I made a tutorial on that. But for Battle Pass, you don't need to instantly play again. You can go to the lobby. There's no daily limit. There should be because maybe some people should be going outside. Almost 2,000 wins? I'm an OG. And I have 914. Just saying. But play like a squad it's not 30 v 30 not 30 v maybe 30 v 30 lucky blocks eh. sky wars no no and um maybe ranked when it comes out but i wouldn't because it's probably going to be five to fives but that's the modes i would recommend and i hope you get a level 50 battle pass quicker than ever anyways a show.